Today we're gonna to talk to you about how to declutter your home. Hi, this is Melody Wilson with the Real Life Team at Remax Elite. I'm here today with Leah Nisley with Engaging Home Spaces, and today we're gonna to talk about decluttering. Yay! So <laughs> if you've watched Netflix and the whole Marie Kondo thing. Yes, it's very popular. Yes, we have a <laughs> North American <laughs> Marie Kondo. She's our home stager that helps us with all our properties and we get them up on the market to list. She helps walk you through decluttering, but I mean, even if you're not selling, decluttering is never a bad thing. Yes. But today we're gonna talk about decluttering your home for sale to actually sell your house. So what's your first thing that you go through with clients when they declutter a house? Yeah, so the first thing is we get three bags, three boxes, and you're gonna label one donate, one throw, and one keep. And so you take those three boxes into every room and be brutal, be honest. What do you wanna take with you? What is no good anymore and what can somebody else use? Yeah, don't donate things that would be in the garbage bin. No, <laughs> fill that thing up. <laughs> and then what do you do next? So once they've got all their, it clearly is gonna probably be more than three bags. Yes. When they're done, they start we with start three. with three bags. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then what's next? Like, what do they do next? So with the stuff that you're going to keep, you want to also organize those into piles and organize them into drawers, kind of like Marie Kondo does. Yep. The crazy folding thing. I don't do the folding. I, I tried it. <laughs> it actually looks really cool. It does. Yeah. Nice but, little lines. Yeah. I put things in little containers. Like from the dollar store, again, you don't want to spend a lot mm -hmm. if you're moving out. Right. But there's inexpensive little containers and you organize all your drawers like that with the yeah. stuff that you're going to keep. She's got crazy Marie Kondo boxes. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. I did not do that. We just literally folded our clothes so it looks all nice and neat. I love and rows. what's your like um, tip on closets? Because when you sell your house, you want to declutter mm -hmm. the closet. Yeah. So how do, like obviously they're going through what you said, keep, donate, or what was the other one? Keep, donate, and throw. Or throw away. Yes, yes. don't oh. forget to throw away. Yes. So what, <laughs> how do you actually like set up the closet afterwards? Yeah, so the closets, you want to aim to reduce your closets by at least 50%. You want 50% of that closet to look wide open. So get rid of clothes that aren't in season. Pack those away. You're going to be moving anyway. You're getting a head start. Um, for children's clothes, especially try to get 50% of those down. And that also helps with decluttering. So yeah, really reduce it and pick everything up off the floor. Organize them into boxes at the top of your closet. And that'll make it look great. Awesome. Well, hopefully those are some good decluttering tips. We could probably sit here and talk for like another hour on literal how to declutter your house, but we're not going to. All right. Another day. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe ask questions. Ask questions below in the comment section. Share this video. We'd love to interact with you guys on social media and we'll talk yes. to you guys soon.